in the name of allah the most gracious the most merciful i am ikram qadar student of bs maths roll number 45 group leader aisha siddiq presentation submitted to sir zishan yusuf the topics of my discussion are magnetic stripe card and smart card first have a look on magnetic stripe card the topics i will discuss in magnetic stripe card are introduction usage how it works its dimensions varieties applications and benefits first is introduction of magnetic stripe card that what actually a magnetic stripe card is a magnetic stripe card is a card that contains a stripe of magnetically encoded data as in the picture we see a card there is a thin black line on the card it is called stripe it is made up of magnets the stripe contains embedded information that identifies its user these cards are paired with readers and writers When the card is swiped through the machine the machine read the data on the stripe used in a wide variety of application for storing information it is also called a swipe card or mag stripe next is the usage of magnetic stripe card most identification credit and membership cards have a thin magnetic stripe across one side of the card by swiping the card through or inserting the card into a reader a computer can read the data on the stripe special computers such as automated tailor machine are made to access it magnetic stripes make card usage much less prone to error because the data is not entered manually while typing there are more chances of mistakes but magnetic stripes make it easy as the data is encoded on the strip the stripes can also contain encrypted information and information that is not printed on the card which can only be read by specialized computers further is how it works the magnetic stripe is actually an area of tens microscopic bar magnets of which there are approximately 200 million per square inch This means that the strip on the card is made up of 200 million tiny magnets. These magnets can be used to encode the data in an infinite number of ways. Like larger bar magnets, one of each microscopic magnet is a north pole and the other is south pole. In an empty horizontal strip all of the bars are aligned left to right so that the north poles are facing one direction and the south poles are in the other direction this means the magnet in the strip are aligned in such a way that north poles are in one direction and the south poles are in the other A magnetic stripe reader has a head much like the one in an audio tape player which can detect the field. The reader converts the analog signal into digital one by turning positive peaks into transitions from low to high and negative peaks into transitions from high to low. Finally, the reader measures the length of each high and low pair. This is how the reader detects the information on the stripe. The physical structure of magnetic strip is shown in the picture. The horizontal black line at the top of the card is magnetic strip. It has 3 tracks. Track 1. Track 1 contains card number, holder number and expiration date. Track 2. Track 2 contains 
card number and expiration date. Track 3 contains the purpose of card as it is occasionally used by loyalty schemes. Below the magnetic strip is a signature strip. Up next is dimensions of card. The magnetic strip size is 85 by 12.55 mm. The position from the top of the card of strip is up to 4.5 mm as you can see in the picture. The varieties of magnetic strip are shown in the table below. There are two types. Number one is high corrosivity. The strip of high corrosivity is harder to erase. It is frequently used. It has long life and it is black in color. Number two is low corrosivity. The strip of low corrosivity requires lower amount of magnetic energy. It is brown in color. It can easily be damaged. The applications of magnetic stripe card that it can be used as various purposes in gift card, membership card, driving license, hotel key, visa, mastercard, telephone card and VIP card. The benefits of magnetic stripe card are that is more secure as it is not in human readable format. It is immune to dirt, water, oil, moisture, etc. That means it cannot be damaged due to any external effect. Data can be customized and rewritten. High data capability on subject of barcode. It can store much data. While non standards. It means that it fulfills all the requirements of being a standard. The next topic of my discussion is smart card. About smart card, I will give its introduction. Smart chip design, its construction, dimensions, types, applications, benefits, advantages and disadvantages. First is introduction of smart card. Smart card is a small card embedded with an integrated circuit chip. As we can see in the picture, a small chip of golden color is smart chip in the card. The chip is either memory or microprocessor type. It is useful for storing and transacting data. The data can be in the form of value, information or both. Next is the design of smart chip. In the picture is the typical model of smart chip. The portions of chip are divided into 8 contacts. In contact 1 is VCC, the power supply. In contact 2 is RST, reset signal, which is used to reset the car's communications. In contact 3 is CLK which provides the card with clock signal. In contact 5 is GRD, ground reference voltage. In contact 6 is VPP. It is designated as a programming voltage. In contact 7 is I by O, serial input and output, half duplex which means it allows transmission of two signals simultaneously in opposite directions. Contact 4 and Contact 8, the two remaining contacts are used for USB interfaces and for other uses. The elements of card are given below in the picture. First, in golden color, is a smart chip. 
the numbers written in the card are the card numbers below the card number the expiry date is written a blue shiny sticker is a security hologram at last under the expiry date member name is written next is construction of smart card mostly all chip cards are built from layers of different materials or substrates that when brought together properly gives the card a specific life and functionality as in the picture is given the typical card today is made from pvc polyester or polycarbonate The 3 by 5 mm security chip is embedded in the card. The dimensions of smart card. The length of card is 53.98 mm. The width of card is 85.6 mm. The thickness of card is 0.76 mm. The length of smart chip is 9.23 mm and its width is 9.62 mm. The chip is positioned 19.23 mm from the top of the card and 10.25 mm from the side of the card. There are many types of smart card. The main types are given below in the table. First is contactless smart card such as high with toll tags. Second is relationship based smart credit cards. Third is contact smart card such as SIM card, license, electronic purses like debit cards. The applications of smart card it is used in financial purposes such as in atm cards fuel cards sims as electronic wallet in educational institutes tracking student attendance as an electronic purse to pay bills and access, access control to some buildings it is also used in electronic tolls information security banking and in e governance e governance is implemented on smart passports to reduce fraud in travel documents benefits of smart card it is easy to use individuals can increase convenience multiple tasks can be done by single card an important key in e governance enhance security a handsome way to deal with the things smart card is easy to use it can perform more than one tasks it is highly secured and can deal in an appropriate way at last are the advantages and disadvantages of smart card the advantages are that it is faster and smarter it is portable we can carry smart card anywhere it has high security as it deactivates on illegal use it is flexible as there is no need to carry separate cards Now the disadvantages are that it can easily lost. There is a possible risk of identify theft because a card cannot recognize its holder. High portability may damage the card. It is expensive. Thank you for your attention.